division. House and Senate chambers full again as Kentucky state lawmakers return to the Capitol for a special session. And I think that much of that discussion has focused on the, the things that we disagree on, whether it be mask or whether it be um, capacity restrictions uh, and, and other shutdowns. But by and large, most of the executive orders were very, very important and I think most people were in agreement with. First on this list, a resolution to extend the state of emergency in the state to 2022 and many emergency orders issued by Governor Andy Bashir. They were things that, that truly did uh, impact and improve the opportunity for um, uh, for Kentuckians to uh, to navigate the the pandemic, things like licensure of healthcare professionals, uh, things like price gouging, uh, things that I think all of us um, could be for. But where lawmakers differ is on the governor's power. The other main topic, education. A Senate bill would nullify the Kentucky Board of Education mask mandate. This, as every county in the state, is in the red. Proponents say it should be up to each school district to decide. To say now that we are not going to require masks in our public schools where our, where our children are going to schools, I think is completely irresponsible of us, and it's bad policy. If a local school district wants to come up with their own protocols and procedures going forward, that's left up to the local control. And Governor Bashir said at his news conference this afternoon, universal masking is necessary to keep kids in school. Molly Laird, WLWT News 5. All right, Molly, thank you.